Premier League Tottenham Hotspur vs Arsenal Prediction Team News Lineups Preview This weekend's Premier League main event comes from a raucous Tottenham Hotspur stadium where Ange Postecoglou's Spurs and Arsenal clash in the first North London Derby of the season on Sunday afternoon. The Lily Whites entered the international break on the back of a 2-1 defeat to Newcastle United. While the Gunners lost their perfect start in a controversial 1-1 draw with Brighton Hove Albion. Match Preview The Street James Park curse continues to haunt Tottenham, who have at least managed to reduce their margin of defeat on Newcastle's turf each season. From 6-1 in 2022-23, to 4-0 in 2023-24, to a narrow 2-1 loss in the third game week of the 2024-25 campaign. Strikes from Harvey Barnes and Alexander Isaac, either side of a Dan Burnham goal, condemned Postecoglou's charges to their first defeat of the Premier League season. One in which a familiar tale in front of goal arose for Tottenham, who were once again punished for not making the most of their dominance. A 4-0 thumping of Everton had seemingly dusted off the cobwebs from game week one. Where Tottenham's wastefulness on the road cost them in their draw with Leicester City, but a lack of ruthlessness is still prevalent in the Spurs' ranks if their Newcastle exploits are anything to go by. Lying smack-bang in the middle of the table in 10th place, Tottenham will also endeavour to end a particular pattern of home results in the Premier League, having followed a win-loss sequence since the beginning of April. Having crushed Everton in their first home contest of the season, the Omens are not exactly promising for Postecoglou's side if that streak is to continue this weekend, but the Lily Whites could arguably not be facing Arsenal at a more opportune time. When Brighton defender Joel Veltman took a wild swipe at Declan Rice in Arsenal's showdown with Brighton, the vast majority of supporters inside the stadium expected the Dutchman to receive punishment. Instead, the Emirates crowd were left aghast when Chris Cavanaugh sent the equally bewildered Rice for an early bath. Already on a yellow card, Rice lightly tapping the ball away from Veltman as he was lining up a free kick triggered the Englishman's second yellow. Allowing the Seagulls to fight back through Joao Pedro after Kai Havertz's delicate first-half lob. As Arsenal and Mikel Arteta were left to lament Rice's highly controversial sending off, which came after Pedro escaped a booking for kicking the ball away in the first half, the Brighton faithful were bouncing all the way home after denying the Gunners. A third win from three matches in 2024-25. Saturday's visitors therefore occupy fourth place in the Premier League table at present, two points worse off than Manchester City and Liverpool ahead of their games on Saturday. But Gunners at least received one piece of good news this week with Arteta's new contract signing. Solace can also be taken from their last two Premier League wins away to Spurs in 2023 and 2024. But they have never triumphed against the Lily Whites in three straight road matches in the Premier League era and head to their rivals' home without arguably their first choice midfield. Team News Tottenham's offensive efforts against Newcastle were not helped by the absences of their two main strikers in Dominic Solank and Richerlison, but only the latter is guaranteed to miss out. There is a good chance that Solank will be available. The Lily Whites were handed a scare over the fitness of Eve Basuma during the international break after the Mali midfielder suffered a heavy knock. But Postecoglou is keeping his fingers crossed that Mickey van de Ven's knee issue will settle down in time for the weekend. Basuma's blow means that Rodrigo Bentenker, who is at risk of a lengthy ban after being charged by the FA over his comments about South Koreans, could be tasked with anchoring the Tottenham midfield. While Sun heung min is out to make the net ripple against Arsenal for the ninth time, only three players have ever scored more in the history of the NLD. Tottenham's one midfield concern pales in comparison to Arsenal's crisis. Though, as alongside Rice's suspension and Mikel Marino's shoulder injury, 
Captain Martin Odegaard sprained his ankle while on Norway duty and apparently faces at least three weeks on the sidelines. Arteta's suggestion that he could be fit may have just been mind games. Odegaard's absence will likely force Arteta to drop Havertz into a three-man midfield, also reinforced by Jorginho. Although if Gabriel Jesus is not back from a groin issue in time for the derby, either Leandro Trossard or potential debutant Raheem Sterling could lead the line, the Brazilian is training again. Though, here in Tierney Hamstring and Takahiro Tomiyasu Ni are definite absentees too, while Ricardo Calafiori hurt his calf in a bizarre incident while playing for Italy but would not have made his first Premier League start here either way. Tottenham Hotspur Possible Starting Lineup Vicario, Poro, Romero, Van de Ven, Udigi, Saar, Bentenker, Kulusevski, Madison, Sun, Solank. Arsenal Possible Starting Lineup Raya, White, Saliba, Gabriel, Timber, Havertz, Party, Giorgino, Saka, Jesus, Martinelli. We say, Tottenham Hotspur, 2-1 Arsenal. Marina Rice Odegaard would have been the perfect Arsenal midfield for Sunday's blockbuster derby. But the Gunners now face being overrun in the engine room while also losing Odegaard's invaluable ingenuity in the final third. Arteta's troops can still expose Spurs' frailties at the back. But we cannot see a way for the visitors to earn the Derby bragging rights with their current selection crisis. North London should be lily white this weekend. Thanks for your watching. Don't forget to click the subscribed button and hit the bell icon for more.